Hello and welcome to Let's Play Hagane, a rock and action platformer for the Super Nintendo. If the internet is to be believed regarding the plot of this game, there's two warring ninja clans, you're a dead ninja who got his brain put in a robot ninja body and the hell with it. You don't need to understand the plot of this game to enjoy it. You're a robot ninja named Hagane. Now go kick ass over five action-packed stages. That's all you need to know in order to enjoy Hagane. And enjoy it we will. Now this game does bear a striking resemblance to the Shinobi series on the Sega Genesis, particularly The Revenge of Shinobi and Shinobi 3. Not Shadow Dancer, because that's sort of an odd one out. You probably know that. But whereas Shinobi had a variety of jutsus to use, Hagane has a variety of special weapons. You got your basic sword, your kunais, and then you have throwing bombs and a cool little grappling hook. Now you also have a screen clear bomb. You can see the counter for it in the top right corner there. We're at two right now. Next to it's our lives. Ain't that great? But unlike the Majin Jutsu in Shinobi, or is it Mijin? I think it's Mijin. That's how you say it. Mijin. Unlike that, you don't have to spend a life to use it, and, well, you can find more as you go along if you get lucky and kill enough enemies. It's helpful for clearing things out, or, like, dealing with bosses. There's one right there. Excellent. A guy is also an agile fucker. He can slide and he can do a weird double jump. Now, to do the double jump, you just have to hit jump as you're in the air during your first jump, but you have to do it before you start to come down. And there's a screen clear bomb. I just used it to use it. I'll get more as we go along, don't worry, so... I could have beat this dumb airship without it, but... Ah, the hell with it. The double jump is a little finicky, and it's absolutely required to beat this game. And the problem is the game doesn't actually tell you that. You'd, you'd have to have the manual or something to know to do that. That'd be a real problem if you didn't have it. But here's stage one, two, and once you beat a sub-stage and go to a new one, you get all your health back. So, that's great. If you were low on health, you can beat the section. Well, all your health back. Live to fight another day. All that jazz. I like this level. It's a cool sewer. It's got spooky music, and well, I'm just gonna throw some bombs because... I hardly use any of those things. Like about the only two special weapons I use are the sword and the kunais. Bombs hardly factor into the equation because if I'm just gonna throw something, it arcs. If I'm gonna throw something, I might as well just throw the kunais. Or get in close and slash with a sword, rapid fire. Speaking of fire, orange fire will refill your health and blue fire will give you Another little hit on your health bar. Max 5. Hold the jump button to do a wall jump. It ain't like Ninja Gaiden where you gotta flick back and forth. You gotta hold the button and do a crazy little somersault. Not very intuitive. Speaking of bomb use, why the hell not? We'll use it on this mini boss. Just throw bombs down in his head. Eventually he bounces. What in the hell are you? Like, a Ninja Battletoad? Ugh, they've come back for revenge. But this guy's super easy. Even if you're fighting on the ground, he's super easy. 
It gives you quite a lot of goodies. Gotta love them victory somersaults. Look out, man! Sandworms. Or sewer worms or something. It's kind of annoying in this stage are these uh, turtles, because they like to bounce. And sometimes you're hitting the sandworms and you can't hit them because, you know, they're completely inside the gigantic sandworm sprite. I keep calling them sandworms. I'm just used to giant worm enemies being sandworms, I suppose. They're more like sewer worms, but whatever, whatever. Big worm monsters. Here's where you can see the platform is a little interesting. You really do have to use that somersault to cross long distances because your regular jump doesn't take you all that far. But whatever, it's fine. Getting health is fine too. This this section ain't so bad. But it's the next section after this one that's a real kicker. It kicked my ass hardcore and was the reason I could never get far in this game until I, you know, learned how I was supposed to play it. Which, I will mention again, is really hard because uh, this game has a bit of a rarity history to it. <laughs> in North America, you can only play this thing by renting it from, like, Blockbuster or something. As such, it's one of the rare Super Nintendo games. You think, well, I could probably find the manual online or something. No such luck. I, I've looked. Believe me, I looked because of reasons, and I could not find it. So, unless you look up an FAQ, you're shit out of luck, and you're fucked on stage one four. Because stage one four is an auto-scrolling section with explodey floors, and you pretty much have to memorize every little part of it. It's very short, thank goodness, but. It's also memorization-based and very hard for this part of the game. It's actually a big difficulty spike. The game doesn't quite get this hard again until maybe stage 4 or 5. I don't understand why this shit is here to begin with. Also, right here. You have to do the somersault jump to live. If you don't know to do the somersault jump, like I did when I first fucked around with this game, you're not going to be able to beat level goddamn 1. But once you know the trick, you can beat that section rather easily and face your first boss. Mushamukuro. There's some weird magical card things to bring these statues to life, and you just slash the shit out of them. Keep an eye on those statues because they pull their arms back and they got big bulky arms and they're gonna try to grab you and squish you. He also shoots fire. Did I mention this guy's a complete pushover? <laughs> At stage one of Hagane, complete. One-fifth of the way there. The game doesn't get quite this hard ever again. So, see you next time, everybody.